<laughs> Jake Eisenberg here with Maryland head coach John Sheff. The Terps just made the NCAA tournament for the third time in four years. Coach, what's that moment like when you find out you're going to the NCAA tournament? It's very um, refreshing. I mean, like from a coaching standpoint, there's there's a lot of work, there's a lot of time, there's a lot of ups and downs that kind of go into a day like this. This is one of my favorite places to come to in College Park because I rarely ever come here unless we come here for this show. We'll bring recruits here every once in a while, but like this this place has the stamp of you come here for a certain reason. So every time I come in here, it's like such a refreshing place to walk into. So. You guys in a regional down in Winston-Salem, the number one seed Wake Forest, the number two seed West Virginia, the number four seed UMBC. Maryland is the number three seed. So your first matchup is against West Virginia, a team that you guys faced in College Park earlier this season and won seven to six. How much confidence does that give you in the first round of this regional? I think it'll give our guys a lot of confidence. We've seen them before. We know what they look like. I mean, uh, Randy does a really good job there. Um, but, you know, I, we have a lot of, clearly, we have a lot of good guys, too. Just, I mean, be, I think it's a good first-round matchup. Uh, it's close so the families can come. Um, I like the fact that we don't have to get on a plane for this. I think it's, there, there's, there's, the pluses are way, way higher than the minuses. It, there really are no minuses. So, I mean, for me, I, you know, I just want to thank the committee for giving us this opportunity, and, and um, we will absolutely be ready. Third time in the last four years that this program is going to the NCAA tournament after really not making it until the 1970s. What does that say about the direction that this program is headed in? Well, I mean, what, what we always strive for is consistency, you know. I told our guys after we got beat yesterday, you know, all coaches are, want their guys to be as consistent and to be able to play well at the end of the year. And I think our guys have, have pretty much done that. We've had some ups and downs, but every team has had ups and downs. I mean, there's no team maybe with the exception of Oregon State and North Carolina, that just roll through 56 games, you know. So I feel good about where we are. We can get on a bus, you know, play good teams. But, you know, I think our guys have earned this opportunity too. We didn't back into this or anything like that. So we earned it, and we're going to go play hard and enjoy the trip. What was your initial reaction when you saw Maryland was going to be in the Winston-Salem Regional? I like going to regions where we don't have to get on a plane. I like, I like getting on a bus. It's an easier trip. We just got off a plane. Uh, we've had bad sleep for the last couple days, so I feel like our guys can get some rest. Um, the families can come and watch. The other thing what I like about it is that it lets us stay on turf. Our guys, you know, they play on turf a lot, so it gets us back on turf, um, which selfishly as, an, as a guy that works with infielders, I like that for our infielders. So there's a lot of pluses. You know, Coach Vaughn will love this place. It's a smaller ballpark to play in. Fecto, not so much. So our guys got to pitch down there. But, you know, it's, it, it plays similar to the way Indiana plays, actually. Coach, congratulations, and best of luck in the tournament. Thank you. Appreciate it. Game one of this regional for Maryland, taking on West Virginia, 2 o'clock on Friday. Maryland Baseball Network will be there in Winston-Salem, North Carolina. We'll be live for Terps pregame at 1.30 Eastern time. Hope you'll join us as the Terps start their road to Omaha.